Hello again, this is BGFH. We're back for another Let's Play campaign of Left 4 Dead 2. And this time we're going to try to tackle the Hard Rain campaign here. We got it all ready to go. Playing on normal again, playing as Ellis, so here we go. There's our movie poster again. I like the cool effect on the Hard Rain title there. And let's see how we start. This should be easy. You just need to grab some diesel. You want to hear a prediction? No. Nope. No. There's not going to be any gas. Watch. <laughs> so, nice start to the mission there. Um, the boat guy that rescued us in the last chapter, last campaign, uh, he dropped us off here because he needs more fuel so that we can go further. And let's see what we. Oh, you are too kind. Well, somebody just got themselves an axe. Indeed they did, Ellis. Okay. <clears throat> so, the interesting thing about this campaign, there's actually a couple different things, is that it really plays with the whole layout structure or layout um, of how the campaigns work. So... We're starting off as normal, we're gonna proceed here. But, actually, we are really just trying to go get some gas, and we're, oh wow, there's no, nothing in there. Okay, that's cute. Um, this is actually gonna be our finale point. So what we're actually gonna end up doing is the first two levels are gonna be going deeper into the world and are into the town to get the gas and then the following two levels we're going to be making it back so you're probably thinking okay well that's exciting playing the same two levels over again just in reverse that's not super fun whoa sorry I almost killed almost hit you there let me grab a gun the other thing, though, that makes this really unique, other than the fact that I'm smokered... Let me grab my gun already. Okay. The other thing that makes this really unique is that on the way back, you know, look at how things are. Eh, it's a little overcast out right now, but, you know, not too bad of a day. The way back is going to be just... We're going to be in this torrential downpour and one hell of a storm coming up. So the levels themselves are going to be, you know, there's going to be a lot less visibility. Uh, like I said, a lot more rain. Uh, oh, sorry, coach. Yep, yep, I will. I'm sorry, coach. Um, so when we... Yeah. Get off. There we go. Uh. Yeah, this I like this campaign a lot better than the uh, swamp one that we did last time. So this one is sheer chaos, but it's fun. It, and I know I've said this in other campaigns too, but usually this thing will go. It'll be really fun, or it will get really bad, really in a hurry. Um. I... What the heck? Did somebody die already? Holy... Oh, wow. Okay. This is... Promising. Yep, we're gonna have to come back through. So... Um... It's getting darker even as we go now. Um... So yeah, what really makes this campaign really cool is just when you come back, the levels of compl Oh, dear jeez, and one guy's dead already, and we're gonna fight a tank? I really hope this isn't an, not an indication of things to come. You know what, I'm gonna get down off of here because I don't want to be punted off. I do not want to be punt- Ow, oh, that's not a, much better, but I do not want to be punted off of a high ledge. Because when that tank hits you like that, damn! 
That was clear over the... F wow. Somebody's pissed. Oh, this is not going well at all. Reload. Shit. Come on, kill the tank. And then we gotta go rescue Nick. Alright, come on, we're gonna go get Nick. And I'm gonna heal. I will, Nick, just give me a second. Oh yeah, alright, you get to be trapped in a porta potty. Nice. Okay, um, that's a mighty fine start to the campaign we got going here. So with that, we'll continue on and hope things improve. Um, okay, so when we hear some thunder coming, so yeah, there's definitely a storm brewing. Boomer! Uh! Killed! There we go. Kill the boomer. Charger! Okay, we got a whole. Oh, there's a shot. Is there any more shots? Wow, they are not. God dang it! I hit my teammate again. Yeah, they are not screwing around this time. We are. We are uh, encountering a lot of dudes. Oh yeah, now the uncommon comment. Dang it! Wow, sorry, coach. This is kind of embarrassing, actually. Um, the uncommon common in this one are construction workers. Now, the twist between the twist on these guys is that they, um, if I remember correctly, they have like earplugs or something. So normally, you can use pipe bombs as an audio distra or as an audible distraction to kind of lower the away from you. Well, not so much these guys, because they won't hear it. Reloading. So that's the trick to these uncommon common. Reloading. And let's hope we can find some med kits or something, because Lord knows we've had a wonderful wonderful time of it so far. And the other thing I really like about this campaign is that just the audio, especially when I'm recording these, I'm wearing, um, doing everything in headphones so I don't get any um, interference or uh, anything like that. And just crowbar, right here. crowbar don't care. And um, the audio in this, just the rain effects, and we go in the, inside the buildings, just the sound of the rain. Really like the audio in this uh, in this particular mission. So we're gonna keep heading down this way. Ambulance. Ooh, yeah, we got ourselves some adrenaline, which will come in handy at some point, I'm sure. I got these pills. Uh, I would really like an. Let's see. Oh, nice. Garage sale. Good lord! Oh, yeah. Go away, construction worker. Uh, there we go. Smoker somewhere. Alright, you got it. Holy crap. Let's continue on. Now, the other thing that makes this... Oh, jeez, I almost hit my buddy again. The other thing, in addition to the weather and just the, you know, going to get the gas and coming back, another thing that makes this unique is, especially as we get into more we cut through this garage, dark and stormy weather here, um, we are going to have to contend with a lot weapons. more yeah. witches. And remember early on, you haven't seen too many walk around so far, but early on, I think in the first mission or campaign's video, I had mentioned that one of the changes they made to the witches in Left 4 Dead 2 is that the witches can move. They don't just sit there all the time anymore. They can walk around. Well, they're 
right gonna be doing that, and I will gladly... What? Oh, okay, I already have a pipe bomb. Sweetness. Alright. I can live with that. Um... But there are gonna be a lot of witches. We got a... Jockey coming around the corner, and I also hear a witch already. Uh-oh. Spitter! Where is she? Where is she? Uh-oh. And a char- uh, Good lord! A spitter, a charger, a... Witch! God knows what else. We've already... Uh, we've already fought a tank. Uh, yourself. Okay, I'm not gonna go into every house. I'm just gonna kind of try to keep moving here and remembering where to go. There we go. There we go. All right. Keep on moving this way. As I said, you will see how on the way back things get a lot more interesting. Oh, Jesus! Hi, Mr. Boomer. That was unexpected. Uh, Alright, screw you guys. Uh, I'll fight off the horde. I could just end it right now, but let's get our kill count up a little. Ah! Okay. Get, get, again, and again. Oh, and a smoker, and again. Okay, now I'll end it. Alright. That was pretty fun. Uh, general damage, not good. Ditto, eh, not last there at least. So we will stop this video and continue on the next level on the next video.